Hello and welcome. My name is Ajax Post and join me here once again in Transport Fever 2 overlooking the delightful and rather busy, although it's a little bit short of trains at the moment, <laughs> Bristol Parkway. Oh, there are some coming in. Good. Yes, I mean, this station should always be busy. There's enough lines coming in and out of here. Uh, and, and to bring you up to date as to where we are, we're just a month or two, I think, after you uh, left me at the end of the last episode, where we added in a new route into... I need to turn the UI back on, don't I? There you go. <laughs> where we added a new route into Bristol Parkway, and that was the long-distance route to Chippenham, which is uh, all the other... Way over here, uh, a single direct service. Uh, there it is. Oh, okay, to Chippenham, here near Bath. It's making a large loss at the moment. However, I do like to be kind of honest with you. No, I do like to be honest, not kind of. I do like to be honest with you and up front. Is I have played on this save game for a year or so more, just to see how everything beds in and works, see where any issues might arise and discover that this service actually turns out to be quite profitable. There are already several people, 34, waiting uh, at Chippenham to go to Parkway. Uh, where's, where are the trains? Where, where are the... Uh, there they are. So they're already a long way away from Chippenham. Uh, yeah, you've only got 11 on you. So by the time this train gets to Chippenham, there should be ooh, 50 people waiting, maybe? That would be good. Now I've lost myself again. <laughs> this map is too big and complicated, too many large towns. Uh, how many are waiting here? 19 to go in the other, other direction. That should be fine. I think that will pick up quite nicely. However, there is, of course, one other thing here you might notice. These nasty blue numbers, overflowing, congested platforms, uh, particularly on the Bristol Midland line which is this one here, going from Bristol Temple Mead, stopping at Parkway, and then going on up to the Midlands to Cam and Dursley, uh, which is a nice, very profitable route. And I'm thinking uh, we could do with more capacity on that. Now, I've, I've lost Parkway again. <laughs> there it is. For some reason, Parkway is one of those stations I always seem to lose. It's sort of in the middle of the conurbation. Well, the outer edges of the conurbation. But it's very close to Patchway, which is another quite big... Well, it's not big, but it's a very popular station. Uh, right, so what do we think? Right, now, uh, we just saw, actually, uh, a 125, an HST, one of these. Oh, it's stopped. Oh, we'll, we'll watch this one, in fact. Coming up. And they stop, and this platform, I think, can actually support another carriage on these trains, I think. Uh, so how long is this train? It is uh, 160. Yeah, I'm sure we can do that. So what we're going to do, first off, there is obviously a, a, a plan of sorts for this particular episode, which doesn't involve just making one train larger. Uh, but we'll get to that in a second. I just want to deal with this while I remember and notice it. So if I manage these vehicles, uh, we can actually edit all of them, I think, can't we? And what we'll do is we'll add another one of these carriages on. Which carriage is that? There's a Mark IV Intercity Swallow. Excellent. Uh, passenger. Uh, can I... Uh, is it Mark IV without a space or with a space? Mark IV it's typed in. Okay. Uh, no, no, no. I want to search. Where's my search bar gone? That's up here, isn't it? Yeah. Mark IV. There it is. Gotcha. Right. Uh, it's just the standard carriage, is it? Yeah. Okay. So what do we have here available to us? Oh. <laughs> the trouble is because I let's let's just do one train at a time, shall we? There we are. Then I can see all the information here. That carries 30, 18, 10, 30. Uh, okay, so we'll, yeah, I want the, I want the big capacity one. Does it tell me how long they are here? I don't think it does, does it? No, we. I complained about that probably in the previous episode. So let's uh, add you, and we'll actually you in the centre between the two locomotive units. 180, that's good. And you're 185 long. You might stretch just beyond the edge of the platforms, but that should be fine. Uh, and let's uh, edit these other two then. The same intercity swallow uh, coach on that one. Yeah, and that one, and that one again just sort them out so the locomotive 
unit. Oh, no, no, in the wrong direction. Doesn't sit. <coughs> oh, for goodness sakes, man. Oh, because it, it moves. And I, I don't notice that. I just keep clicking randomly. Yes, yeah, a nasty habit I have. Okay, we'll modify you. 13 million, just for an extra couple of carriages. Right, let's watch this train come in. Just make sure he does actually sit reasonably nicely on the platform. There aren't that many going in the other direction, to be honest. Only 62. But it should save losing too many people at the station. Oh, look. Oh, yes. No problem at all. That's good. Okay, now, the other, the main thing I want to do today, one of the main things I want to do today, I might actually get more than one thing done, but if I keep talking like this, I'll get none of them done, is, you may remember a while ago, we had a couple of services going through sort of the suburbs of Bristol, a sort of local service, calling at, where's Frenche? Okay, we've got Frenche here. So, we want you up and you up. Okay. Now, initially, if I remember correctly, this was one long route from Warmley all the way out here for no particularly good reason to Avonmouth North, it, which isn't a terribly popular destination or whatever, but, you know, there are people. It, it, it carries people, and it serves, I think, as a feeder. I think that was the main thing. It serves as a feeder for the main other routes, except it's not really. And as you can see, they're not making money. I mean, this Avonmouth to French A1 is, but it's, it's not a lot. And the French Shader Warmly one here isn't doing anything either. Largely because I think there's either fairly good bus services in here, or people just find it's quicker and easier to get in their car and drive. So what I was thinking was, this might work better if this route was connected in to an actual major train hub. And you know which one I'm thinking of, don't you? I am thinking here, and I found it first time, Bristol Parkway. Now, what occurred to me when I first looked at doing this is I could add this on uh, as simply uh, one end of a long platform. I could turn one physical platform into two logical platforms, if you will. I'm not sure what the right term is here. I mean, any of you train and railway aficionados and experts uh, can tell me if there's a proper term for this. But if we look here, because what I've done, for example, uh, this uh, platform here, adjacent to the main building, is actually two platforms, platform two and platform three. So it serves smaller local services like this one here at both ends. Yeah, uh, what I've done is I just put a bit of ordinary track in the middle. I was thinking I could do that also with what is platform four here, because platform four is currently servicing Parkway to Yate. Again, another small local service. Yeah, so I could just add another train onto the end of that platform to this end of it. But then I thought, well, actually, could I? Because this is getting complicated and messy, and we'll dis discuss that more in a moment. Could I actually extend Pla Parkway a little bit more? Could I make it wider? And you know what? I discovered, I discovered, if I can find some, pla uh, some tracks, there we go. I can. It does mean I can need to demolish some uh, some housing estate here, but um, I haven't done that for a while. I I have I don't do very little of it, so maybe the residents will excuse me this one time. I could add them in here, alongside this main Chippenham to uh, to Parkway route. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to turn these two routes. Uh, we're actually we're going to keep them as two routes, but we're going to connect them in to Bristol Parkway. Yeah, the only issue we've got here is if I turn on all the routes, is this is quite a busy intersection here. So particularly for the Parkway to Avonmouth North route, it's going to be connecting or crossing over with the Parkway to Bedminster line, which is the brown one, the Bristol Midland fast route, which we just noticed, the 125s, and also a fairly busy a uh, rail, uh, rail freight route uh, from Avonmouth Dock to Down End. So, yeah, it could be fun here, but I think we can do it. But I'll probably want to keep... I think if we, yeah, if we add in another section of track here, so we make this bridge bigger. In fact, what I might do... Uh, can I get rid of that bridge entirely? 
the only junction we've got here is with the depot. So I could rebuild this bridge. I think that might work. We've got some funky junctions and switches going on here, but okay, we'll deal with those as we come to it. Okay, let's crack on then. Let's get Parkway reconfigured. Uh, no, I can't do that first. I need to demolish uh, these houses, I'm afraid. Cheerio, old chap. Uh, no, if I click the right button. There you go. And you're done. Now we can configure it. Parkway is electrified. Several services are. Um, this, These existing services aren't at the moment, but just in case we electrify, I'll add electric track here to the station. It doesn't need to be a full length. Here. In fact, we don't need it to be that long either. Hmm. Actually, I'm wondering what we could do. So I'm slightly concerned about the amount of space we've got here coming in here. So we might make it that much shorter. Yeah, let's do that. We'll see how that pans out. It depends on the on the curvatures I get when we're looking at uh, putting the, the actual connecting track in. Okay, we want a regular... We're going to stay with, I think, uh, old GWR Brown. There we go. And you. And an empty one at the end. Have I got an empty one? Uh, there, should be, uh, there should be an empty one here somewhere. Where is it? Oh, is it you? You're empty. Yeah. So if I put you there. That's cool. Uh, some canopy, of course. Uh, where the canopy is. There's the canopies. So we'll put you on uh, there. Oh, actually, I should have put the underpass on first, shouldn't I? So it's easier to see. But there you go. There you go. Uh, so there's a GWR underpass. That's it, the brown one. And the underpass is... Yeah, it's on this piece of platform here. That's lovely. Okay. So that's that. Okay, let's get rid of these units here. And some track. Shall I, I make the whole thing electric? I could do. I could do. We might well put electric uh, local trains on here at some point. Now, how are we going to do this? Actually, what I might do first, because the curves are a little bit tight here. Let's get this train out of the way. Because we're taking this track here to get it up there, crossing over this. No, you go... It's always another train. <laughs> now, the slight issue we've got here is that it's going up here, as you can see on this bridge. But this freight line is also elevated. And I think getting this track above that might be an issue. So what I'm thinking is we might have another crossover here. I think. Let's try that. We'll try this. Okay, and get rid of you. That's it. And I'll take you back. We'll leave that there, see if that works. You look very ugly, so let's smooth you out. Yeah, it does, the, the, the re-landscaping does make some odd choices, doesn't it, at times. Okay, so, yeah, you're electric. So we've got a signal there. What I want to do... So if we're coming from here... Yeah, can I get here. It doesn't seem to want me to. What about if I go around this way? Ooh! It does like look like it's doable. It's a bit tight in terms of curve, but it looks like it might be doable. Okay, let's get these signals out of the way. You, for a start put you in mm. 
Now, I think I probably do need to take this back under the M32, which nobody appears to be using. Yeah, that's the way of things. And I dare say, doing this will really upset this piece of, of road under the motorway as well. Okay, so can I connect you? You are really... Oh, you're going really slowly, aren't you, there? So if I connect you... Oh, I can connect you to that. Okay. But can I take you then from there? Oh, it looks like I might be able to. Oh, my goodness, I can. Although it is... Very, very slow. Unless I do that. It's slow there. Be nice to have a... Really slows down at this end. <laughs> Where do I want it to slow down? As it enters the, uh, the curve or as it leaves? I think entering the curve, I think... That's probably our best compromise in terms of speed, isn't it? But I don't like that old bridge. No, we wouldn't build a bridge like that these days. We want something funkier and sexier. On the assumption that you can have sexy bridges. You? Yeah, you're not exactly sexy. You are very functional, I think. So I'll put you in like that. Which means then we're going to have... Yeah, you coming in there. That's fine. I think this all oh, this could work. So where's our other track? Coming in here to connect up to uh, there ish. Okay. You're looking good. I mean not possible. Yes, of course you're possible. 20? What? Uh, well, this is the inside of the curve, isn't it? So, mm, it is going to be that bit slower. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm going to have to join you there. And this is... I don't want to join the track. Oh, no, you're, you, you're not that... You're a little bit fast. You're not 29 anyway, so that's good. Okay, I'm bringing you along here. Okay. How? You are pretty much the same level. Mm -mm. uh, no, I'm going to leave that. It, it's it's kind of offensive to the eye, isn't it? But we can, mm, okay. <laughs> so if I take you, how do I get you to join that bridge? Like so. That's quite sweet. Apart from the fact that it makes a mess of this here. Yeah, that that's no, that's unacceptable. I mean that is only a depot line. That track there is only to enable trains to get from the depot to to the other lines this side of Parkway. But no, that's 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 not acceptable. Okay, so bring you through to there. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we're good with that. Actually, what might be useful is, can I take this and that? Get that train out of the way. You're not going to stop at a signal, are you? No, no, good. Okay, let's. I want to check where that depot track is going. So it's coming in here. Uh, you can get across to here. Yeah. Uh, that, that could do with being double slipped, I think. Because there's no other way across from there. Okay, if we double slip that, get rid of this little bit of track there, that little stubbin. Uh, so, we want to come from here to... there. Okay. Can we take you off there? We can. That works a treat. I'll double slip you as well. 
just in case I need trains to go from the depot to that platform. That works quite nicely. Yeah, okay, let's, uh, so what we then want to do is join this up then on that side of the junction. The switch for the depot track. Now he's done a. St uh, I, no, no. That's the trouble sort of with these these long switches. It really does seem to make a mess of the tracks. I mean, look at that. I mean, no. I mean, is that real? I mean, as as I've said many times before, and I dare say I'll say it several times again. <laughs> I am no expert in trains or railways. So yeah, would a would a long switch like that really exist? Would it? Would it work? Okay, right. So that should serve our uh, warmly to a new warmly to French uh, to Parkway line, stopping off at Frenchay. So that line is going to be extended. We now need to make sure. Uh, now this gets fun. Oh, actually, no. This all this double slipping and stuff here will work in my favour. I think. So we can then get onto this line here where this regional train is, which is the Bristol Parkway to Bedminster line. Get onto that. Which can then connect, I think, onto the Avonmouth line. Oh my goodness. It looks like it might work. Let's put a couple of signals on here. Just to make sure that I don't forget. Uh, that's the one I want. We'll make you one way. We'll have you stopping there. Do we want another one? We probably do. Oh, we've got a slip there for some reason. <laughs> Not quite sure why, but you know, there you are. Have you there? That's quite a long stretch. We'll put one here as well. Yeah, it's a bit close, but you know, there you go. Now these are going to be quite short trains, these local services, so yeah, I don't need to worry too much about junctioning. Uh, sorry, distance between switches here, I think. Uh, that looks a little bit naff, but it works. There's nothing, I think, yeah, impeding the track itself. Actually, that does look a bit messy, but mm, I'm not going to worry about that too much. <laughs> okay, now we want the passenger trays to have precedence over the freight, even if it's a local surface. So we'll put this signal a little bit further back here. And this signal here for the freight line can be much closer to the junction. Okay, that's good. And likewise, this end, we'll put you there. Oh, actually, which means that I don't want that signal there. I want this train to have slightly Slightly have precedence, have slight precedence over there on that switch. That's good. Uh, have we got switches coming out? No, we haven't. So we'll put a switch, uh, sorry, a signal. Oops, there. And do we want, yeah, we'll have one here on the entrance to the station. That's good. Yeah. That works for me, I think. I'm getting no red indicators at the top, so it looks like all the routes I might have interrupted are still good. Okay, let's see if we can fix. Uh, I didn't want to do that. These two routes. Okay, so we're looking at French A to Warmly to start with. So this is this one here. We're gonna manage this line. We're gonna go from French A to Bristol Parkway, which is now up here. It's picked the right platform and it is perfectly happy. That is splendid. Uh, from Bristol Parkway, it needs to come back to French, eh? And Eastfield, warmly, Eastfield. Yep, that looks good. Okay, so we'll leave you there. And this line here, Avon, oh, autosave is kicking in. So we'll come back in a second. Right, thank you, autosave. They seem to take so long now, but then again, with a very big map, and I've got about 330-odd mods in the game. Yeah, I dare say there's a good deal to uh, to save. <laughs> okay, Avonmouth to French, eh? 
uh, will manage you. And you're not going to French A at all. You're going from Westbury on Tim. Should I take French A off there? From Westbury on Trim, you're going to Parkway. It doesn't like that. It's rather annoying. Then back to Westbury. Oh, gone to the, it's gone to the wrong platform for a start. Platform number eight, which you still don't like. Okay. Now, oh, the uh, mixing up our dark blue colours. Our dark blue here on the map is the Bristol Midland line. So let's uh, change this colour so I'm not confused. We'll make you a nice yellow colour. Okay, okay, you can get to Westbury on Trim. Okay, so you're coming out of this station here, in fact, which is the passenger one. You're sharing a bit of track with a freight line. And then I'm really happy how this uh, inter switching between the, the freight line going sort of east west and the passenger line basically north south ish roughly <laughs> works. But uh, okay, so if we, what actually where are you coming from? You're coming up here, so you're on this line, the lower line here. We want you to come up here. Oh, of course, you're on that bridge. Ah, okay. Actually, this that this might work. Actually, yeah. I was thinking I'll have them both on the same platform, but actually, I could also do here what I planned to do initially, which was create two platforms here for this service. Uh, so that would be platform four, which is this one here. Yeah, because the Bedminster train is a fairly short train short train, uh, if I didn't pronounce that correctly, <laughs> which calls in there. Yeah, let's actually do that. Uh, then we can get it on platform four, which I think will work. Actually, uh, where is it? Uh, French A, Avon Math to French A, which it's not. If I put you on terminal four, you still don't like that, do you? Not, may, uh, not quite sure why. Ah, uh, that's, do, 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 you should be, ah. Uh, you know, there's a cross over there. Okay, well, let's let's do this anyway. Because uh, I, I think it's a fun thing to do. So we'll configure this. And what I want to do is demolish. Uh, yeah, that, that bit of track there. And then put in some ordinary track, uh, which will be track. Uh, get in here so I can see it in there. There you go. Right, and that should now give me, yeah, two platforms. Okay, so, yeah, so the parkway one can go to terminal. Five, yeah. So Parkway can go to Terminal Five. Sorry, Yeat Nine Acton. Yeah, you can go to that end of the platform, and the Avonmouth one can come in this end. Okay, that's okay, except it doesn't work. Why are you not working? I do not understand you. Okay, so let's manage this line. Can we get from Westbury on Trim to? Uh, what that signal there? No. Oh, okay. Why ever not? Ah, is it a matter of slippage on these? Yeah, I think it might be on here. Uh, okay. <laughs> Not entirely sure where these trains are running. Let's get that back up. So, like, okay, so your the light blue is the freight train. Ah, yes, of course. Right, so you're right. Yes, so I need you to double slip that junction. Let's get our service back into view. There we 
Okay, you still. Oh, I picked the I picked the signal on the ugh, you idiot. I picked the signal on the depot track. Aha! Right, so it can get into Parkway now. It can get to its platform. It just needs to be able to get out again, which I think should be a matter then of slipping one of these. I think it's that one. Gotcha! Excellent! Right, oh, that was uh, simpler than I anticipated. Could I make that better going in there? Hmm. Actually, what might work is putting... I'll put a waypoint in there, not a signal. So I want this uh, the, the warmly train, sorry, the French eight, the, the, <laughs> the Avonmouth North train to come in on this track as well. I don't want it to switch over quite so early on approach. So we want a waypoint. There we go. So if I put you in there, and then change this line to go to where's the waypoint? That waypoint. That's better, I think. Yeah, yeah, I think that. Yeah, I'm I'm happy with that. Okay, that's cool. Right, we've got that working. What trains do we have on these two routes? Uh, we have got. What are these? These are. Whoops, one uh, fifties carrying sixty two at seventy five. Are they the best train for the job? Let's Oh, I need to change the names of these lines as well, don't I? So Avonmouth to Parkway. And this is going to be Warmly to Parkway. Cool. Right, uh, what was I looking at? Oh, the, the train. Yeah, the trains. Uh, what do we have? We're in 1999. So I think we, we should have a fair selection of trains available to us. Um... Yeah, uh, what are we looking for? We will, we're will. we not searching for Mark IVs anymore. We are searching for multiple units. These could be electric, actually. Yeah. Uh, we'll sort by type, I suppose. Um, hmm. Actually, yeah, let's, let's so what have we got here? Four, five, six, which goes seventy-five, and you carry thirty-eight. Actually, what do these count? Oh, you carry sixty-two, don't you? You're oh, you're quite capacious. Oh, no, you're you're the big expensive train we've got going to Chippenham. Yeah, we don't need you. Four two. Ooh, ooh, you carry eighty-four. You're quite fast. This this is going to be a slow line, though, isn't it? Uh, you, you go 90, 72, mm, these are all a, gosh, <laughs> a little bit fast, really. Yeah, for, for this sort of route, we, and unless I know we're going to make money, I think I'd rather stick with something a little less expensive, so, yeah, not you. Uh, what have we got up here? The one six. You go eighty nine, seventy seven, ninety, eighty. Mm. How much do you cost to run? You cost me just over a million. You cost me one and a half. The one five six. You only carry forty though. You carry sixty. I think you may still. Ooh, are you longer? Your three carriages. Now, what I'm going to do? I'm going to let this bed in, and then make a choice. Yeah, this is me prevaricating. I'm sorry. It is. Uh, we'll see how much traffic these build up. However, I think we could do with another train on. Uh, on the Avonmouth line. So I will commit to that. There you go. Right. Let's crack on and see 
uh, get the game running and see if that works. Everything. Oh, something's stuck. Train 14. Bristol Midland. Why are you stuck? <laughs> what do you mean you've got no path? Oh, yeah. When you start fiddling with platforms, they do get confused. If I stop you and start you again. You're happy. Good. There are no warnings. Okay, do we have Oh, what are you Oh, you're the new train. You're looking good. Going up here to your platform. Oh, there's our Chippenham service. He made lots of money, but he was significantly in debt already at this point. This is what we want to see. Lots of trains coming in. You're only going to carry 26 back to Chippenham? Oh, well. How's the route itself doing generally? Still rubbish. Okay. Oh, and there are already three people who want to go to... Avonmouth or Westbury, one of those two. That's fine by me. Okay. Oh yeah, and this is our electric Bedminster service. You're coming in nicely. It's all quiet on this big interchange. <laughs> Don't you hate that when you want to see how something complicated works? All the assets you require are somewhere different. Oh, something something's gone wrong. Okay, and there's a train coming in from Warmley. What's this error? Train 15. Bristol Midland again. Are you, are you in Temple Meads and you're, 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 you're stuck? Maybe this is to do with advanced routing that the game uses. You're still stuck. Okay, what is the problem with this route then? Yeah, I know you're stuck. Stop telling me off. Uh, okay, da 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 da. Okay, yeah, yeah. There is a perfectly good route. There is nothing broken here. I don't know what your problem is, matey. Look at that, you see? Perfect. Okay, if we turn you round. Oh, hang on, that's the wrong train. <laughs> train, was it? Oh, it's train 15 that's got the problem, isn't it? Oh, it is. Uh, where, where are you now? Oh, you're coming out. Uh, okay. Oh! I see. You're too long for Bristol Temple Meads. <laughs> oh, bother. Right, yeah, it's this uh, junction here, this switch here. Okay. Right. Ow. Oh, heck. Could I make Temple Meads longer here? Actually, let's see if we can do that. Oh, it looks like I can, actually. It looks like I can. Cool. Uh, which makes sure this will be an empty one. Yeah, that's fine. To there. Uh, and also here. Yeah. And this, this is its ordinary high-speed track. It's not electrified at Temple Meads. That's good. Okay. Which means I can... I could, well, I didn't need to get rid of that switch. But, you know, this. Not catenaried. So we could... Oh, dear. Oh dear. <laughs> Are you going to let me do this now? Right. There you go. Stop playing silly beggars. That's it. Cool. Right, there are no warnings anymore. Splendid. That should deal with that. It's quite possible that another station on the other end of this line might have trouble, but I'm sure it will warn us about that. Oh, good. 
these these trains appear to be working okay you're waiting for a free pass where no you're not are you or you're coming into parkway actually yeah could do with some signals here actually yep you're absolutely right and we'll put a, another single here signal here ahead of that switch there that should be fine and Oh, that's not Parkway, that's French. <laughs> so, no, that's um, Westbury on Trim. That's what that is. Um, yeah, I think we're all right there. Okay, where is that train? You're there. You're good. Where are you going? You're going out to French. Uh, so, yep, yeah, to French A down there. It seems to be working quite nicely. Good. Now, one other little thing I was planning on doing, uh, again it ties in once again to Park Way, was to add, if I can find it, where the heck am I? Right, over here. Do you remember our airlines? Yeah, we've got a couple of uh, air routes, uh, one from Bristol to Newport and one from Bristol to Cam representing kind of the, uh, the the Birmingham air airport you know, this map doesn't go anywhere close to Birmingham it stops at uh, Cam and Stonehouse or Stroud yes yeah, so it's not terribly far north what I was thinking of these are all, all the airlines are quite profitable so there's no big deal with that but what I was thinking was we might have a stop at the airport on the train yeah so rather than just having this sort of tram stop here between the two towns of is that Thornbridge, Thor, Thor, Thornbury and Cam, is actually have a stop on the main Bristol Midland route up here to the airport. Should we do that? It should be fairly quick, he said, hopefully. <laughs> yeah, famous last words. Uh, it's, it's, going to be, it's going to need to be a... Does it need to be that big a station? Actually, I'm wondering. Not sure. Uh, okay, oh, I've got so many new stations here. I really should play with these. I say this every episode, don't I? Uh, it's going to be a passenger station. Uh, monorail, fixed stations. Oh, fixed stations, what's that? Ooh. Oh, I quite like the look of you. You're going to need to be quite large, though, for the train. The thing is, I'm not sure we can modify these. If, actually, if I let's place you down and see if I can modify you, get you more in line. Can can we connect you to? Ooh, just about. So if I do that, no, I can't modify it. So it need, it'll need to be 240. I think that I I like that. I like that actually. Uh, can I upgrade that track though to high speed? No. There's a very fixed station. <laughs> so, okay. Can I then uh, get uh, track type catenary high speed? Uh, no, we'll take the catenary off it because there's a diesel line still up here. Oh, transit track. Oh, I love transit tracks. Oh, there was a mod in, station mod in Transport Fever 1, which I think was called Fix... Actually, it might well have been called Fix Station. Oh, no, Flexible Station. And it put in transit tracks for you automatically. I like that. Yeah, so it put that transit track in the middle. Uh, I don't think we need them here, though, to be honest. Um, do, do I? No, we'll, we won't do that. <laughs> I can always rebuild the station. If, uh, if I need to. So we'll put you in here. But I do need to get you connected to the tram stop. I can always fiddle with the road in a minute. That's as good as I'm going to get, I think. So if I put you in there... It's a really nice looking station. Again, all the mods I'm using 
uh, in my Steam collection. And the link to that can be found in the description below. Uh, so track, uh, high speed, no catenary. Can I take you to there? I can. And you're maintaining a superbly acceptable speed. You're looking a little bit iffy. Approach there. Just need to tidy you up a little bit. And you. It's a bit of a curve, but it, uh, except I didn't actually connect that track. Do it again, but properly. Why, why is it? What's this problem here? What is its problem? That's better. Hmm, not quite sure why it didn't want to connect there. That's good. And along here. There you go. That is superb. And this we're going to call you. You're not Cam Central by any stretch. We'll actually call you Cam Airport. Like so. There you go. And uh, we've got this tram route here, which this train station will negate the need for, certainly coming from Cam. Well, we'll see how it plays out, actually. We will see how it plays out. But let's edit the Bristol Midland line. And we will have you. So you're going from Park, from Temple Meads. Oh, from, from Yate. Right, from Yate, you'll stop at the airport. And coming back out of Cam and Dursley, you will stop at the airport. Oh. Interesting ter platform. No, oh no, that's that's not the terminal numbers. <laughs> that's the stop numbers, idiot. Okay, cool. We'll see how that works. That may actually just exaggerate the capacity problems we have on this route. Because when you've got more stops, there's more chance of people not being able to board a train at a stop because there are people going beyond it. But we shall see. Uh, you're, oh, you are going to stop at Cam Airport. Excellent. Watch you get up here. I dare say no one will get off at the airport. But maybe on the way back, they will have learned it's there. Certainly on the on the subsequent trains, they will. Let's go a bit faster, shall we? We're only going 88 miles an hour. Come on, you can do more than that. Yeah, this, this tram route here has uh, it's come close-ish to making money, but never... Oh, actually did one year. Good grief. Didn't expect that. Oh, uh, oh, this is cool. Oh, okay. Maybe you'd already left Cam. <laughs> Cam and Dursley when, uh, when I put the stop in. Hmm, possibly. But well, at least you fit on the station. But well, that is a very nice looking mod. And not quite sure why we need sound barriers here. This is going to be a very noisy environment anyway. What with air, air, aircraft and everything. I like that. And we don't really need steps going out the back either. Hmm. Okay, well, other than that, I like the look of it. Anyway, that I think is it for this episode of Transport Fever 2. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you have, it'll be great to hear from you. A little bit of a like would be lovely. Even better, if you've got anything to say about how I'm playing the game or... Ah, what we'll do... Hang on, I want to catch this train here. We'll do a little bit of a cab ride on the way back. Ten people going... Okay, that will do. Um, <laughs> about the... No, don't do that. Let's... Uh, don't move the mouse. That's it. Uh, yes. Oh, no. I... Oh, dear. I need to get rid of that uh, house. Uh, yes, yeah, so any, any thoughts you've got about the game or what I'm doing or, or any suggestions for improvements in my routes, it'd be great to hear from you. Just drop a note into the comments box below. That would be awesome. Other than that, of course, if you've not already subscribed to the channel, you could do that now. And that way you'll know when I upload another one of these or any of my other Let's Play series. But from me, Ajax Post, here in Transport Fever 2. Until the next time, bye-bye for now.